my friend at the old country church. Sometimes in fond memory my thoughts go back to the old country church that I attended as a boy. You know, it's kind of funny how we cling to the old bygone days and bygone places. Why, it seems only yesterday that my mother closed my childish hand in hers and led me down that long, winding road to hear the Word of God. And according to my Sunday school teacher, God was supposed to be everywhere. And too, I seem to sense His unseen presence there in the old country church more strongly than any other place I have ever known. There with the humming of the bees and the singing of the birds, drifting in through the open windows, I just knew that God was surely with me. I knew it as surely as if he'd laid his hand on my shoulder and said, Welcome to my house, son. But all the years have passed, and time has brought many heartaches and many tears. I have seen my mother pass into the great beyond, and many loved ones have followed. I have watched them go with tear-dimmed eyes and tear-stained face. And now in later years, as I stroll along the grassy footpath to the old country churchyard, I am consoled with the thought that their rest is a peaceful one. And once again I seem to hear the voice of the great shepherd say, Welcome to my house, son.